Usher shut down last night's Super Bowl. Come on, I guess that's 58. I think the po- folks yeah. who don't know who know, we say LV111. With his all-star <laughs> halftime performance, <laughs> the king of R&B put on a flashy performance that included a number of surprises, including Usher dancing on roller skates, the sonic boom of the South, my alma mater, the Jackson State University's marching band was playing with him and spelled out his name. You Plus sure that wasn't Southern? Here. Somebody told me that was nah. Southern. <laughs> no. Nah. No, that wasn't Southern at all. <laughs> that was the sonic boom of the South. Get it right. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Jermaine Dupri was out there with church socks on, Lil John, Ludacris, <laughs> Alicia Keys, Will I Am, and her. So he took a moment to acknowledge his haters during the performance, saying they said I wouldn't make it. They said I wouldn't be here today, but I am. Can we? Let's we, listen to a little bit of it. Man, shut it down. When Luda came out, and Lil John, come on, man. (laughs) We we love Jermaine Dupri, but can we talk about the socks? Ooh, them, they called them Bobby socks back in the day. Yeah, they were somebody socks. That's like them granddaughter Easter shirt. Yeah, yeah, I was just about to say that. And I mean, and I mean, he stood, he stood with them socks on. He stood on business. Yes, sir. Yes, he did. Yeah. You think he knew what he was doing? Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. Mama got him dressed. Maybe somebody dressed him. Huh? She laid that Prayer outfit mama. on the bed. And that outfit laid out on the bed. <laughs> <laughs> and it was a low camera angle, so you saw the socks first. Oh, you did. Man. The ruffles. Yeah. Uh, he looked like a pilgrim. It was great. He sure did. You're going to say it was great at the end. Look like a pilgrim. It was great. <laughs> it was great. <laughs> Back Shout out compliment. to the number two Usher board <laughs> for the socks. <laughs> did you see that post? People are talking. Here's what's trending on the Ricky Smiley Morning Show. As you know, Google Trends Live tweeted many stats on what Americans were searching for during the game. Of course, Usher came in at number one. Jermaine Dupri's socks came in at number two, Ricky. Uh, number three, people were asking what was the lowest scoring Super Bowl. That was um, when the Patriots beat the Rams 13 to 3 in Super Bowl 53. And searches for Super Bowl overtime rules spiked 4,200 percent after regulation ended. Alicia Keys' red piano at halftime caused a spike in searches for adult piano lessons near me. And so we'll have to see if people actually follow through with that. All right, so this morning we want to know what was your good, bad, and uh, what the hell. Uh, Let's start with you, Maria. You know, I thought I really love Andre Day, um, the Black National Anthem. I thought that was a beautiful way to open up the Super Bowl, and it was nice to see a little blue ivy. I think she's just so classy. I, I love seeing yeah. her out there with uh, Jay Z. So uh, those were standout moments for me. And what, what about your what the hell? Oh my, what the hell? Um, definitely the socks. The socks. Okay. Um, on Jermaine Dupri. I didn't like that styling choice. All right, Gary. Mm. You know, I mean, I watched it with my friends, but I really didn't pay no attention to all that stuff. But I didn't like the um, commercials. For one thing, that was my what the hell because I'm not that astute on. Uh, all these shows y'all be watching and stuff. People laughing and so what are they laughing at? Because I don't understand. I mean, I remember the Jennifer Lopez and Bill Affleck one, the Dunkin' Donuts. The Dunkin but Donuts. I don't. Yeah, but I don't. What was funny about all these things? That was a great commercial, it. Gary. Yeah, but I don't get it. I just don't get that stuff. I do not get it. Every year I watch <laughs> Super Bowl at my friend Kennedy's house. I just don't get it. And as, well, hell, I wouldn't. I'm sorry. <laughs> and then what's the other part? I don't know. It was the, the game when it was whatever. I just didn't like the idea of the way that guy talked that talked to that um, referee. You know, Kelsey. Uh, Kelsey. I didn't like the way he did that. Man, that was that was, his coach. That was his coach, not the referee. Oh, that was his coach. Yeah, that oh. was his coach. But it's always real. All right. Uh, so for me, her playing the guitar that was a oh, super yeah. good for me. Oh yeah. I, I I knew she was a talented vocalist, but I embarrassingly didn't know she played guitar that well. So I had to yeah. do some research, and uh, that was a big good one for me. And of course, my alma mater, the Southern Boom, uh, playing the the Sunny Boom of the South, playing with with Usher. That was a big surprise because they kept it on the low. Um, so that was dope. And uh, my homie Mike Burton was playing a saxophone for them. But I'm with Gary on the on the what the hell. I couldn't really believe that that was happening with Travis Kelsey. And like Maria said, if that was a black dude, like the internet would have went crazy. 
And I just hope he take it easy on Taylor Swift. He might flatten her booty even more after uh, <laughs> this, this win. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that thing definitely flat this morning. <laughs> what do you think, Kenny? Uh, my good was Usher's entire halftime show, the, especially the roller skating part. Um, I like that. The bad was, uh, I don't know. I, I hate that Alicia Keys hit that bad note. But um, the she what the hell. She didn't hit a bad note. We're we going to go through that. little crazy note. Okay. But she the, did the, not hit the, a bad note. She was not. I, I think she okay. hit all the notes. Okay. But the, but the what you asked so, But the what the hell was why did he take off his shirt and make my wife look at me with even more disgust when I got undressed last night? <laughs> 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 it's all the man boobs. I'm like, damn, I'm oh. going put your shirt back on. You make it off. <laughs> all right. My wife is like, God. All right. Before we go to the phone real quick, what you got, Rock T? Man, the good was definitely Usher's performance. I did like that Dunkin' Donuts commercial. That was my favorite. Really? The, the bad was Trev- Travis Ke- Kelsey going at Coach Andy Reid on the sideline and the what the hell, of course, with them doggone Jermaine Dupri socks. The bad, the bad, the bad for me was a, a damn storm came in direct TV. If you go over that damn uh, <laughs> segment, like all of it. I did catch a halftime show, but then got into uh, overtime. A damn storm came, and then my direct TV could not connect to the damn satellite that's up in space. And then uh, I had to listen to it on the phone. And it, th- that, that was that was the bad for me. But I did, you know... Uh, Shout out to uh, uh, the Divine Nine, Kappa Alpha Psi, uh made it yes. uh, to the damn halftime show. They should have went on and got Beta Zeta, had my nephew, uh, Paco, uh, who got videos out, who was in the Missy Elliott video. They should have had Paco, they should have had uh, 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 LaBert and Deuce Solomon, man. They had. They should have had, had them on it. But, you know, just just shout out, shout out to them. Let's go to the phone. What are your thoughts? Good morning. Are you facing an unexpected? Hold on. Wait, I thought I had, we got phone calls or, or, this, or, or the phone lines jammed. So many people calling. Oh, oh, most people from Birmingham. And, uh, my good is, you know, Kansas City won the Super Bowl, and I thought my bad was that game was just it, it, up until the fourth quarter, the game was terrible. But my, what the hell was, why do they always pay a ton of like he's commissioner? What the hell was uh, Ice Spike doing with Tennis Swift? They just didn't make no sense to me. Hey, this is Ro from Louisville, and my what the hell moment was what was those Easter socks that JD had on? What, 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 why? I like the Super Bowl, called for Greenwood, South Carolina. But what kind of outfit, ask Brett, what kind of outfit did I'm Jermaine Dupree have on? <laughs> <laughs> Hi, this is Valerie from Cincinnati. My bad was the a dude white, and they pulled a pants down or whatever they had to do. They didn't make any, it was unnecessary, that commercial. My name Corey, I'm calling from Seaburn. I'm calling from Seaburn, Florida. My good was a good game. The bad was, uh, man, we still we still can't pass Taylor Swift. And my what the hell was the hell did uh, J.D. have on his feet, them socks, man. I'm calling from South Carolina by way of Jackson, Mississippi. The good was the Jackson State Sonic Boom of the South playing. The bad was the fans were terrible. And the what the hell was, why did Jermaine Dupree have on the little girl ruffle socks that you buy at the Chinese hair store? Bush Drive Rich, calling from Jacksonville, Florida. The good, that was a good performance by Usher. The bad, that was bad commercials during the the, uh, whole Super Bowl. And the ugly, Jermaine Dupree in a tuxedo with shorts. Come on, my man. You're too old for that. My name is CJ. I'm calling from Morella, Louisiana. And my good was Beyonce's commercial and Usher's performance. My bad was, dang, that first note Alicia Keys hit. I don't know what to say. I don't know. Uh, maybe ever since she saw that lady husband, she ain't been right. Am I, what the heck was, what the heck was Jermaine Dupree wearing? <laughs> play a day, play a day. You got what? Play a day. Some people Mm-mm. want it all, listen, but listen. I don't want nothing at all. She hit it. Just she the beginning. the first note. The Just, first note. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Stop, stop to me, stop to me. Some uh, people want it all, but I don't want nothing at all. Now, what note you said? The first note? The very the first, very the song. first note. Yeah. Oh, that's nothing. Psalm. Damn, y'all I'm trying to act like y'all didn't hear that. Yeah, it yeah, was a couple on, of notes. Yeah, yeah, it's not a couple. Where's the second one? All right, tell me what the second one It's a little further Some than what you're supposed to 
That's it. it. She, she hit brought it, it back on the second one, but on the first one, you can't act like okay, she didn't so hit The mic, the mic went note. in and out. You know how it uh-huh. is when the mics be going in and out on that. Uh, 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 and then sometimes they don't turn those mics on yeah, but uh, Rick, on time because they, no, Gary. Now you're trying to make an excuse because you're a musician. That she was wrong. She was wrong Rita, when she Rita said is, some Rita is people want it all. And then she paused because she knew she was wrong. Then she got, said they have none at all. We got two musicians on this show, professional musicians. Rita, did you hear her? What is your thoughts? Well, the some, you know, it was just a little uh, up and down. Some, you know, just like a little some. And then after that, mm-hmm. she she got back. She, but she had a little but, frog in her throat. She is an AKA, so she just had a little frog in her throat on that first that first some. <laughs> oh. She brought it back. 